Hey everyone, welcome back. In this short video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the SongMaker app. You'll be seeing me using it on my computer, and if you have any questions, please feel free to send me a short email. So once you click on the link that I provided you, it will bring you to this window that says SongMaker. Now this is a really fun thing. All you need to do is take your mouse and you click on any one of these boxes and it'll create any of those sounds just like that. You can go down to here where it says marimba and it'll change to either piano, strings, or woodwind, or synth. So there's many options, but what it'll do, this is really neat actually, you can click on any of these squares. Once it's colored in like that, that means that that square is active and it'll make a sound, okay? So then you click on another square like this, and basically, it's much like the xylophones we use in music class, and you can make any sort of sound you want. Now what we can do, and this is a lot of fun actually, is we can click on this button down here, the play button, and this little song we just did, it'll play like this. Not really interesting, but you get the point. If you go up here to where it says restart, it'll clean you up. So you have like just a clean slate, and you can just click and just make anything you want. It's a lot of fun, actually. I wonder what that sounds like, what we just created. A little interesting, a little bit different. But again, you can play with it, right? Now we go down here to where it says electronic. And it's blocks, kit, conga. What that means is that's for these bottom ones here. You see where my mouse is scrolling here? That's for these bottom ones. And that will make a percussion sound. You hit the bottom one, and it's more like a sort of a bass drum, hard sort of sound. The top one, kind of like a snare sound. So you can make a, um, a bit of a drum beat that'll go with your song. So for example, let's try this. And then we'd do this again. Let's just do one more, and then I'm going to create a song right in here. And I'm just going to make this up as I go. I'm just going to sort of see where I go with this. I'm not, I'm not using any sort of formula. I'm not using any sort of... Um, real methods for composition. I'm just showing you this, how, how it can work. So let's see what we've recorded now. A little interesting. Actually, now that I listened to the drum beat, I don't know about you, but I didn't really like it that much. So I'm actually going to restart that so I can just do some more stuff here. Another fun thing you can do is the tempo. You can make this thing play as fast or slow as you want. Okay? Now again, I'm just I'm just clicking random blocks here. I'm not trying to make anything. I'm not trying to re reinvent the wheel or try to compose that next great new piece of music. But let me show you how the tempo here works, okay? Right now, as you'll look down there, you'll see it's at 120. Here it is at 120. Okay. Well, what happens if we really speed it up? That's going to sound kind of cool. 201. Sounds kind of fun. So just based on these set, now I'm going to go back to restart. It puts the tempo right back as well, okay? So just based on those settings, I just want you to play around with this. Have some fun with it. Don't worry about saving for the time being. Don't worry about the mic or the settings or any of that. For the time being, just enjoy this app. Sort of have fun with it and see what you can do with it, okay? Thank you very much. Have fun with SongMaker.